service that I got from Beverly Hills Physicians was very, very good, excellent. It was a clean atmosphere. From the moment that I made my appointment, they were very helpful and provided me with so much information. Once I met Dr. Chu, I felt very comfortable with him. He answered all my questions, showed me before and after pictures from his other patients. Leah was my consultant and she explained all the information, what I was going to experience and the medication I was supposed to take. The procedures that I had done was the breast augmentation and tummy tuck as well as a little bit of liposuction. I am extremely happy with my results and I've recommended so many people. My aunt, she got her um, eyelids done. Three of my girlfriends got breast augmentation and my sister got liposuction and all of them have been extremely happy as well. BeverlyHillsPhysicians.com is one of the largest plastic surgery corporations in the country with seven locations from which to choose. Beverly Hills Physicians have led the plastic and cosmetic surgery industry for over 10 years while serving thousands of satisfied customers. As a full-service plastic and cosmetic surgery practice, BeverlyHillsPhysicians.com offers breast augmentation, breast enhancement and reduction, tummy tuck, liposuction and liposculpture, chin and cheek implants, nose and eye enhancement, face, neck and brow lift, cap and buttock enhancement, podiatry, female corrective surgery, Botox, Restylane, and Captique. Customers frequently commend Beverly Hills Physicians for excellent patient services and beautiful, natural-looking results. Many of our plastic surgeons are board certified. And the spa-like surgical facilities at BeverlyHillsPhysicians.com are fully accredited by the American Association for Ambulatory Healthcare. My best friend referred me to Beverly Hills Physicians after she had done a lot of research on other doctors. She told me about how friendly and helpful the staff was and that she was thrilled with her results from her operation. My initial consultation was really great. I was greeted by a friendly staff and I had all my questions answered and I felt really comfortable choosing Beverly Hills Physicians. I would recommend them to all my family and friends. I used a payment plan. Beverly Hills Physicians helped me set it up in spite of the fact that I didn't have perfect credit. On the day of the surgery, my OR staff was amazing. They were really friendly and they made me feel really secure about the operation. After the surgery, I used the pain pump and it made a huge difference in controlling the pain. The post-operative staff was amazing. They made sure that I was feeling okay and I set up an appointment for the next day. The next day I went to see the doctor. He assured me that everything was going to be okay and if I needed anything, I could call him any time of day or night. I am absolutely thrilled with my surgical results. I look great. I feel great. It's one of the best decisions I've ever made. We take pride in offering these patient services. Insurance billing. Exceptional financing plans. Concierge services for out-of-town patients. Pain pumps and patches. Recovery suite with 24-hour nurse access and customized meals. Post-operative custom-fitted garments. VIP transportation to and from home or hotel. Beauty gift bag to maximize your new look. The best part about choosing Beverly Hills Physician was I had no worries. My internal medicine doctor highly recommended them and spoke very, very highly of them. The procedure I had done was a bunionectomy and a hammer towel. The surgery itself was not painful. Afterwards, there was some discomfort, but they gave me the tools that I need to ease the pain by using a coolant and by using the electrolytes. And I had no problem whatsoever with my insurance. The staff was more than helpful in doing everything as far as the billing for the insurance and taking care of all those kind of matters. So I didn't have to worry about anything on that. It was just a wonderful experience and you don't feel like a number. They made you feel like a human being.
The overall experience was excellent from the moment I first contacted their website to the follow-up visit I had with the consultant and within two weeks of the initial contact I had my procedure and was on my way to recovery. You're watching KCAL 9 News at 2. Call it a Cinderella story with a little help from Nip Talk. In order to fit into the proverbial glass slipper, some women are going under the knife to achieve the perfect foot. High heels, sexy flats, saucy stilettos. They may be all the rage, but what if your feet are flawed? One toe is longer. Second toe sticking out or not fitting into your favorite shoes? Just have it shortened. Toe shortening is basically when we remove bone uh, from the toe and we physically shorten the toe. Have you had any problems since your uh, surgery, which was Friday? Toe shortening can be done for cosmetic and medical reasons. Here's an example before surgery and after. Podiatrists Robert Joseph and Dominic Signorelli have seen more and more women come in for toe shortening over the past five years, and they tell me there's a reason why. Vanity. I guess for well, one word, vanity. Uh, the fact that um, women like to have their feet look the way they perceive a normal or beautiful or sexy foot to look. I feel very comfortable with um, the changes or the, um, the procedures that were, were done on the left foot. Karen Moreno's feet were causing her not just emotional but physical pain. So she decided to have some of her toes straightened and one of them shortened. So what happened? Um, pretty much being a slave to fashion and forcing my foot into pointy shoes. She says in many ways vanity caused the problem in the first place, but it also brought her back to the doctor's office. I think that if you don't like something about it, then go ahead and change it. Well, you're back. We're talking about your cheekbones, right? Yes. When I look down, I can't really see anything. And it's pushing against my eye. It almost looks like I'm tired. There's a lot of risks associated with removing the cheek implant. One is the tissues atrophy. They become a little bit thinned. Well, that's why this is trickier than putting them in in the first place. Mm. Tap them and have you tip your chin up a little bit. I'm going to kind of put a few marks on you. As it stands right now, the most reasonable operative plan will be to take out her cheek implants through the inside of the mouth. When we pull out her implants that she has right now, we'll be able to see how things look. We will be prepared to take another implant at that time, different type of implant, and actually fix this to the bone, actually screw it into the bone. The challenging aspect of today's surgery is trying to take a patient who wants perfection, who has already had three operations, and make her perfect. Tabitha's surgery went exactly as planned. We were able to get the implants out and reposition alternative implants and change her cosmetic appearance in accordance with what she was looking for. You call me if there's anything you need. Back, Tabitha. You look great. This was much easier than I thought. I'm glad I had my cheek implants removed and replaced. My face doesn't feel as hard on the sides, and I have a softer look.